You see the drip season is in peril right now. Lightweight, boy, lightweight. What is up guys, your boy Simon is back at it again. Guys, today I'm taking you through a full day of eating. A lot of you guys ask me like, what do I eat on a daily basis? As a college baseball player, trying to put on as much muscle as possible during this quarantine. Trying to get those gains, man. I'm trying to throw 100 miles per hour, trying to hit 100 miles per hour. Yeah, guys, I'm gonna take you through a full day of eating. We're about to eat breakfast right now. Some people do intermittent fasting and stuff, but I make sure to get some food gains right when I wake up, man. But I'm gonna eat some food and then head to the field. But before I show you guys, let's get a baby cue the intro. Field. Making our swings right, making sure we got backspin on the ball. What to do, Thomas? How's your swing feeling? <laughs> swing's feeling really good. So she can play some games. Oh. Hey, the Iowa hat can fly though, dude. Hey, that's why the swing's feeling good. <laughs> Alright guys, just a quick update. Our season is in peril right now. Yeah, we don't know if we're having a season. We're in uh, Los Angeles County. Guys, send us some of your game clips. We just miss watching baseball at this point. <laughs> dude, all these kids in like Virginia have been playing the games this whole time. I have to go all the way out to like San Bernardino to play a game. Even then, that got canceled for like some of my, uh, some of my high school friends and stuff. But yeah, we're gonna keep getting that work. We gotta stay ready. We're Juco boys, man. So we gotta, gotta do our best to transfer to another school. Transfer to a four-year. Yeah, that's what Valley boys do, baby. When my friends go, it was simple. When the ends low, switch the tempo. I got right, I got heart, I won't die, I'm a fight. I go down, then I strike, I go hard day and night. Yeah. You guys, it was a good day at the field. Started to get some ground balls after hitting. This NAI team that practices over here kind of kicked us off, so we had to, we had to finish up. But yeah, guys, I am headed home. I'm gonna show you guys the second meal of the day. Hey, yeah, I was good. All right, guys, we are home in Kinez household. You guys already know we're on to the second meal of the day. I got some home-cooked grilled chicken and rice. Shout out, mom. Probably leftovers from last night, but I am psyched because I'm actually starving right now. Dude, especially like when you're on the field, kind of feels like cardio a little bit because you're moving around, and it just totally gives you an appetite. Right now, I'm in a caloric surplus, so um, I gotta be eating. Be eating a bunch of meals per day. Yeah, I'll put the macros like down below and stuff. And yeah, let's get eating. All right, guys, you already know that was already gobbled up. But yeah, guys, I'm feeling tired. So right now it's only like 1 p.m. So typically I like wait around for Alec to get here when he's like done from work and then we go lift. But I'm trying to implement where I hit. So I'm about to get some more hitting in, man, because my swing was kind of feeling off today at the field. Got to dial down on some things. So yeah, let's get to the cage. A few moments later. All right, guys, I'm so lucky, man, that I have a cage in my backyard. I'm trying to hit like twice or as many times as I can a day. I'm trying to put reps on my best swing to make it routine, make it second nature. I know a lot of greats hit multiple times a day, but a lot of of guys barely hit a day but hey man everybody's different like some major leaguers like don't even do t-work but then some swear by t-work so there's so many hitting routines comment down below what your hitting routine is i'm curious to see before it starts coming down on me right now i'm gonna get to hitting Solid bucket and a half. Swing's feeling better again, man. Guys, one of the main problems with my swing, sometimes my upper body gets started before my lower body. My lower body doesn't get engaged as much and then I muscle up balls, which makes me super inconsistent, yada, yada, yada. But lately, I finally had some breakthroughs with my swing where my hips were going before my hands. Everything felt like super whole. There wasn't this crazy head movement. Trying to get back to that. Maybe I'll play some videos of me doing it well. But yeah, guys, always have something that you're working on in here. Don't just have like a blind swing because that might do more harm than good, to be honest. Always have something you're trying to work on. Always have something you're trying to do better about yourself to improve upon you know the valley boys do baby after this random i'm gonna put up a valley boys banner it's gonna be so sick dude yeah guys alec is gonna get here later i'm gonna get started on my workout because he hates doing power cleans so i'm gonna get those over with right now first i gotta pick up all these balls but let's cut right to the list Guys, just finished power cleans and look who showed up to the crib. Oh, oh. That's right, the notorious ALEC boy. What? <laughs> what? What? Valley Boys hat, you guys already know. <laughs> lightweight boy,
All right, guys, we just crushed that leg workout, bro. My quads at least are pumped right now. I got after with the assisted hamstring thingies at the end. Alec didn't even do them, man. You know it was good. I'm fucking tired. I'm about to go home, post up, and sleep, boy. <laughs> Same. But yeah, guys, right now, I'm gonna have my third meal. I'm starving, so I'm definitely gonna have a meal after that. And yeah, let's get it. All right, guys, just took a fresh shower. We got the post-workout meal. We got the chicken breast. We got the pasta for the carbs. And we got some greens, the broccoli. I'm gonna heat this baby up. Right now, I don't currently have a protein. I've been eating all my calories. Any protein companies watching this, sponsor your boy. Yeah, I'm gonna eat this, do some homework, and then on to the next meal. Three minutes before the deadline, baby. Had to get that assignment in before 11.59. Dude, I'm the king of procrastinating, man. I gotta get my stuff together. But yeah, man, I am still hungry, and I'm trying to stay above 3,000 calories. I haven't been tracking today. I'll track in the edit so you guys will know how much I ate today. But yeah, let's make some PB&Js for the final meal. When my friends go, it was simple. When the ends low, switch the tempo. <laughs> Guys, I'm not gonna lie. I was gonna pretend like I made that the whole time. But it's me. <laughs> to get the cinematics, guys. Typically, I eat two peanut butter jelly sandwiches either before I go to bed or like sometimes as an additional lunch. But we're kind of running out of bread, so I'm gonna save some for tomorrow and have one. Typically, it's at least like this much bigger. Bread. I guess we bought baby bread. I don't know. But yeah, guys, I'm also gonna take vitamins right now because I didn't take them in the morning. I usually take it with my first or my last meal. And I'm also gonna take out my creatine. We got biotin, men's one a day. A good old creatine, baby. This is the creatine I use. It's called Dimatize. Uh, one serving size is two tablespoons, and I just dry scoop that and then chase it with water. It's five grams of creatine in total creatine monohydrate. Yeah, a lot of you guys have been saying I've been making crazy gains, so appreciate the love, but I kind of just started taking creatine, so maybe that's been helping. All right, boys, this is how you do it. Typically, uh, you do pre-workout, but guys, I'm not gonna fill up a water bottle. I got flavorless, just so it's quick and easy process in the morning and the night. Go spoonful. Flavorless, but it does kind of have a terrible flavor. Another one for the gains. All right, boys, that's gonna be the end of the vlog today. I hope you guys enjoyed it, man. A lot of you guys have been asking about my diet and stuff, so I was like, you know what? Let's just put a whole video on it. Yeah, man, especially during this COVID time, man. We gotta make those gains, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I hope that helped. You already know how we Valley boys do it. We get after, we go hard, especially when nobody's looking. I'm trying to be the best version of myself, you guys. You guys gotta hold yourselves accountable. Make sure you guys get that work in, like a true Valley boy. Speaking of the Valley boys, man, go cop yourselves a hat on valleyboys.shop. If you guys cop one right now, I'm throwing in a free sticker. Because already now, just throw it on like a folder or something. Throw it on your laptop look at these babies are sick yeah man i'm not all top man i live and die by the valley boys look at this dude i even got it tatted on my leg put that to focus valley boys we go hard make sure you guys subscribe make sure you guys like the video comment down if there's any video ideas you guys want to see gonna be posting a lot more guys try to post monday wednesday saturday look forward to it man turn on the post notification bell go follow me on my ig at stephen Knez. and now guys that's gonna be another video today see you guys in the next one peace